forgot this is what this looked like. Oh, he looks so adorable. Well, not your face, but you know, your little dinkle arms. Those were, those were hilarious. Oh, I love that tune. Hey there, strangers, my name's Neos, and this is Contra, the anniversary collection with Contra Operation Galuga coming out in about a week, which is a remake of the original Contra. And we played a demo of that just a few days ago. People seem to surprisingly like that quite a bit. So, hey, thanks for that. Uh, but I thought it would be kind of fun to go back and play Contra. No subtitle, the original Contra, not the arcade version. This, by the way, this is the anniversary collection, came out a year or so ago, has a lot of the Contra games. In fact, most of the Contra games does not have hard corpse, like the original hard corpse, not the Contra hard corpse. <laughs> it does not have hard corpse, not the original Contra hard corpse, but hard corpse, the one I mentioned in previous video by Arc System Wars that I freaking love, that's just stuck on the digital store for PS3 and 360, which is annoying. Uh, or the Wii game, uh, Contra Rebirth, I believe. Both those are super good. They're not in this collection, though. Uh, but we're not playing the arcade version because I don't have much of a history of the arcade version. We're going to play the original NES version, which I also don't have the most history with. I've never actually beaten this game. So what do you say we give it a shot and see how the, uh, the new game compares to this one, shall we? This is kind of a cool thing where you can watch replays of the game going and you can actually jump in at any time while it's playing and just continue from there. That's pretty neat. What do you say we start us some Contra in good old four by three? Oh yeah! There's the dude again. It sounds all bit crushed and nasty. I love it. Oh wait, hold on. I press the button. Actually, you know what we should do? Does this have any sort of uh there's gotta be a way to like access the, oh, saving. Oh yeah, look at this, we got all sorts of stuff. Hold on, reset this game because, because we've gotta do it. Everybody, together, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start? I don't actually know what B and A would be on a dual sense. Uh, and that wasn't it, or was it? I'm not sure. Anyway, for those of you who somehow don't know the Konami code, or the Contra code as was also known, um, it gives you uh, 30 lives which we may, I thought I saw a 30 on there. I may have accomplished it, I'm not entirely sure. But hey, look, we got machine gun. We've got, I guess R is rapid fire, I don't know. <laughs> oh, look at this background. <laughs> I guess those are mountains and like the tiniest trees ever, or maybe, oh, hey, this one explodes. Oh no, <laughs> jump over it. Okay, good to, wait, where's the jump button? Am I not jumping? Okay, can't jump out of the water apparently. All right, gotta know, or good to know, if I'm firing, apparently the jump button may not work at the same time. I've already survived longer in this game than I did in the much easier, oh yeah, I'll just spread gun. I want me some spread gun, there we go. Okay, you can jump and shoot, I don't know why I didn't feel like doing that in there, you go. Just a flamethrower, whoa, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> it starts. I was like, maybe I could get through Contra without dying. Yeah, good luck with that. And not play much Contra. Of the original, original Contra. I, I mean, I say that, I've played it. I used to uh, haven't played this dearly as much as the other ones. I, re, I, I grew up playing the Super Nintendo and Genesis ones. I love those. I used to play those over at a friend's house because I hadn't known either of them. And as soon as I like got into retro gaming, I'm like, I must own. I must get this now. So I freaking love those games. Wow, it's uh. So this doesn't have the shoulder buttons because <laughs> this was an NES. I'm, tr I'm pressing buttons that don't do anything. Is that a button that just gave me the gun? Did I do something weird there? Oh. Oh, there's a rapid fire button. Oh, that's neat. Look at that. Modern control stuff. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let's see if we can grab this. So I haven't played that much of the uh, anniversary collection, apparently. I don't know what's going on. Let's get this. Spread gun, spread gun. Oh, yeah, look at that. It can only have so many sprites on the, the screen at once. So shoot five, but if you keep firing it, it starts firing all sorts of like weird combinations. I'm gonna keep the spread gun, spread gun's super good. So unlike the remake, uh, we can only hold one gun at once. So if I were to grab that, it would go back to the, I guess, rapid fire, which is a machine gun. Go oh, wait, it doesn't fade, does it? Ah! <laughs> I was gonna hit that guy anyway. So anyway, I wanted the rapid fire. Uh, I just thought it'd be kind of fun to uh, try it out. And uh, <laughs> I mm, did not practice this at all. By the way, the, this is the, the Contra collection, uh, and it shows on my Steam account. I have played this for one minute. Apparently, I fired it up to see if it worked and then didn't play it for some reason. I don't know. 
I mean, in all fairness, I do own this on, uh, I own this on the, the Switch first. So I think I got it when it was on sale. I was like, yeah, more Contra that I never used to play. <laughs> all the other thing. That's okay. But hey, if you saw the Operation Galuga video, you might recognize this wall boss. It is just a wall, and we gotta destroy the various parts to get to it. They also had this in, um, Contra 3? It was Contra 3. Hey! But Operation Galuga, you had two of those, and then the background attacked you, because that's how that works. Hey, we have 28 rests. I think it's more lives. Oh, hey, this is what I was talking about. Okay. In the previous video, I was like, I wonder if they're going to have any sort of, uh, like, first person? I don't know what you'd call this exactly. I guess over the shoulder. Yeah, this is some proper over... Oh, look at that. <laughs> so good. <laughs> ah, that's a joke. Um, I mean, they tried. It's, it's cool that they did that. Whoa, you duck under that. It's, it is kind of a cool idea. And a lot of these uh, original Contra games, they would have uh, ways to mix up the, the gameplay uh, between levels. Um, in uh, Contra 3? Was it 3? Yeah, I think it's 3. You had uh, the ability to go into, like, it was a top-down. Well, I say ability. There's just certain levels were top-down. And it became like a twin-stick shooter. And that was pretty cool. Uh, but this is this is a neat idea. Um, but uh, yeah, they did not have this in the remake for some reason. Maybe it's because it is hokey as butts. <laughs> yeah, suck it, wall. You got nothing on Contra. I was kind of looking into that. Apparently, the 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 people are called Contra. I guess the the type of soldiers. Oh, oh, I didn't duck in time. I don't know exactly what that means. I guess they're super soldiers or something. Ow. And also, once again, I don't know if I said that in this video. Uh, this is Contra, so one hit deaths. There is no option to not have that happen. I guess, however, we can, like, what's the button to. I did that earlier. So, uh, there we go. I mean, I might as well, I can make save states. There you go. Maybe I'll do that between levels so that we can actually make progress. Like I said, I've never actually beaten this game. Contra is notoriously hard. I mean, I'm not gonna front and act like, aha, I, I, I totally didn't use the Contra code, and I'm super good. I edit out all my deaths now. It, like, I like to be real, you guys. I, I, I've, I've shown enough of my faults and screwing up on this channel. I don't think anyone's going to think that I, I'm faking that. Not sure what all those uh, metals are. They actually activate, like, super, like, more damage mode or something. I don't know. I don't remember those being... Or maybe that's how many lives we've got. And we've used the Konami code, so we've got more more lives. Might be the case. Oh, we can knock that back. Good to oh, Didn't help with that, though. Okay, yeah, can't hit the reds back, but we can hit your little circle things and destroy them. Yeah, like that. Yeah, we did it! And we, we, no deaths! Oh, yeah! Woo! Play this in multiplayer, because you have two players. They go to either side and go up. It's adorable. Look at it. Stage three, waterfall. All right. Hey, so this is like the, uh, the second half of the Galuga demo. So I'm just going to keep referencing that, apparently. I have played several variants of this game. I like you have the Operation Galuga is the most recent one. Um, they'd had, weirdly enough, I think two, maybe three. Oh, laser. Let's try that. Uh, different, like, mobile phone variants, which, of course, you're like, ah, oh, mobile, uh. That, I mean, they were surprisingly decent. Hey, you, get out of there. It, it's, so you can only fire so many sprites. Fire sprites. You can only have so many sprites on the screen. So like this, it goes across like that. Like, rapid fire, it just pulls it back. That's so weird. It's almost like a mini flamethrower. There we go. Um, can I blast you? Hey, fuck your head. Yeah! Did I get... It made it ding. Did I get a life out of that? Maybe. But, um... Of course, just like all half-decent mobile things, it died. Um, I, I actually really liked the, uh... So, the Contra was... I think there's a more recent one that's kind of like your... Ooh, what you got? Oh, well, I guess we got this now. It's invincibility! Yeah! I don't even know what that symbol was. Let's just try to run through this before we use it up. There's a, a current one, just like there's a current Castlevania um, mobile game. It's actually pretty solid. It's bit gotcha, but it feels very... I, I ignore gotcha mechanics. I just... I'm immune to that because it annoys me so much. Um, I just play as the... Oh. Huh? Oh! Are we back? Or is it still... It's all recorded. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> the internet. They're like, Konami's like, did you say you ignore gotcha mechanics? How dare you say that on the internet? We want your money! Um, I assume that's what Konami sounds like. Um, at least current Konami. Hey, at least they're letting people make some games. So that's cool, right? <laughs> Should be, hopefully. Ooh. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna keep doing this. 
Hopefully we can kill that thing. Um, but yeah, ignoring those, uh, the the older uh, Contra, I think in the modern one as well, and um, Castlevania mobile games are actually pretty solid, other than the fact you're playing it on a phone, so, you know, no touch, like, no buttons. Use a controller, but that's just awkward. And, you know, it's just still not as good as, like, a, a game that was made to be single player and, you know, feature rich and all that. Anyway, I wonder what this is. Wow, it's a big alien boss man monster. Uh oh, is she shooting the eye? Where am I shooting you? Uh, it went ding. Where am I shooting in the hands? Oh, I shoot your hands off. I thought I could go further to the left. Apparently, I cannot. In the mouth? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's just like in the new game. Ah, oh, they've taken so many ideas from the new game for this. <laughs> okay, blow his arms off. Man, this is so... I forgot this is what this looked like. Oh, he looks so adorable. Well, not your face, but, you know, your little dinkle arms. Those were, those were hilarious. Your face is nightmare fuel. Uh, so please go away and don't let me see it again. That's, I know it's, your whole thing is to be a big old scary monster man. But more importantly, you did. I think we took as many hits on that as we did in the demo of the new game. I'm going to talk about that a lot. We're just going to date this video. I'm sorry, but that's my most recent Contra memory. Um, yeah, but we like died to the, uh, it took one hit to that. We died and then we uh, beat it without getting hit again. Okay, let's just fire this in the middle. So I don't know if I really explained this very well before. But this being the over-the-shoulder thing, you can duck under bullets, so they shoot low, obviously still gonna hit you. We can't walk through those electric barriers, uh, so that's why we have to stay back there and destroy the button. But uh, then we just have to... Oh yeah, this actually have to shoot low at. Ooh. Get him! Get him! Get that button! Fight the wall! There's so many wall-based bosses and enemies in the original Contra. It's charming and weird. Oh, I forget you can break those. I guess I didn't play a ton of the original Contra. I have fired this up so many times, just because I, I love Contra, like, a lot. Uh, but I tend to play the later ones, so I'll go back to this one, like, oh yeah, I just want more Contra, it's like, oh, this is old! <laughs> and it's not necessarily a bad thing, I like some really old retro, if you've been on this channel for any amount of time, me saying that's the most obvious thing in the world. Do you know I like retro games? Oh, this is crazy, I know, right? Um, but, you know, I, I grew up with the slightly higher fidelity and actually just like uh, more actiony gameplay. Lasers! Even the lasers I can't reach down the hallway. But I keep mashing it. It's interesting. So yeah, I just haven't played as much of this as I have other ones. It's still good though. Like it, it holds up pretty well. I'm just, uh, I like having a little bit more action and control and uh, not having to do this. I'll just keep, I'm just gonna do this. If you explode, it's your own fault. Uh, for not aiming down. Maybe nothing shoots at the ground, I don't know. Oh, that's probably what the rolling things are for. A doy. That would make sense. Good job, Brain. You got there eventually. There we go. Uh, R... I don't know what R is. More laser. Okay. <laughs> R for laser. There's an R at the end of laser. In the Contra world, we abbreviate using the last letter. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, here we are. Time for the final wall boss. Maybe not. Whoop. By the way, I have no idea how many ah, levels this has. Hopefully we will uh, we'll get somewhere. Also, I should probably have done that whole saving thing that I was talking about, because I don't know if we're going to... I don't know if I don't think this game continues. <laughs> I actually don't know. Like I said, I haven't played much of this original one, so I am I am unaware. I am very uneducated in the ways of the original NES Contra. Even though we're playing this on a PC in the year 2024. What did it say when this came out? Oh man, this is probably either like 87 or something. Like this was, this is NES, NES. So that would have been late 80s, maybe earlier 90s. I forget the, when did the Super Nintendo come out? I don't remember. What's the blue guy do? Oh, they get little jetpacks and then lets them like jump at me <laughs> or little wings or something. I don't know. Oh, see so blue guys jump at you, red guys shoot at you. I'm like the red guys might have a better idea. Okay, so one of those is the real one, I assume. There it is, out. Or maybe I have to wait till they get together. And you only shoot them when they're not in a phase of... Yeah, oh, that's interesting. All right, well, you stay right here, because apparently I can blow up your projectiles. I didn't know it was going to change direction way <laughs> through me saying that statement. Ah, so good at video games. I mentioned that I love retro games and their BS ways. <laughs> ah, shooting faster. Don't like that. Hey, let me, uh... You get in front of my, uh, my pellets. You get a little, little pellet. Just 
he looks more actually when he's aiming it up, it looks like he's using like a, a blowgun or something. Just spit wads. They're just like, ew, don't shoot me in the brain with your spit wads, Contra. Can't tell me what to do. I'm Bill Riser, I think. I forget what his name was. Um, and Lance Bean? Lance Schmantz. I forget his name. Anyway, I think I got the name right. We'll find out. But I mean, after this video, I'm not gonna look at it right now. Stage five, snowfield. Onward to the snowfield. See, I feel, I remember the snowfield because this has the the football players. And no, I didn't just make that up. <laughs> That's for some reason. Or is that the boss? I can't even remember. Um, but uh, yeah, I don't know how many more levels there are because we've got this in most, it, in contra fashion. And I guess it technically started here. Uh, we're going to have a gross alien hive, I'm pretty sure. Then outside of that, I don't know. Ah! Okay, we attack from all sides, don't like it, no! <laughs> Infinite spawning enemies, I didn't mention that either. Everybody knows about Contra, right? Everybody plays old things. Fortunately, not true. Okay, what if rapid, is R just rapid fire and just make all of your guns shoot faster or something? Oh, I just, uh, oh, I was safe! I was mid-air, I'm like, oh, there's bullets down there. And then I fell between the bullets like a huge badass and then walked into them like a huge moron. <laughs> moron ass. No, this flamethrower is the weirdest weapon ever. There's that, ooh, a screen nuke. And, uh, rapid fire screen. Okay, maybe it does just speed it up. Okay, I'm learning about this super old game. It's almost as old as I am. Uh, ah! <laughs> Using a flamethrower and somebody in the water doesn't work. Come on, come on, come at me. I'll take you out. You got nothing. Yeah, ah, freak. I didn't realize that he was going to use strategy <laughs> and his bomb would explode. No! <laughs> I was holding down apparently I pushed forward slightly, which makes you just go like that. Oh, it looks like he's rocking out though. It's like... <laughs> I want to attack with a guitar. This is the 80s. We can do cool stuff like that. Oh, I forgot about you. Hey, could you, uh... Ugh. Yeah, do that. I'll just be... Oh, uh, huh? Okay. Neat. <laughs> this is... Oh, this boss is ancient. No! Can I jump on top of you? Excuse me? What was I supposed to do there? All right. Maybe I just need to damage it faster. Duh. I'm just punished for not being good enough at murder. Maybe. I don't know. You know, it'd be cool if I could see how many lives I had left. I know it shows it between levels, but... Oh, that guy vanished. He was like, is that Contra? Is that Joe Contra? I'm out of here! Oh no, okay. Try this again. So let's get more shots on you. Ha ha! I'll have to see if you can like jump on its head or something. You know, its robot head. Uh, how many shots do you take? No! Ah! <laughs> okay, do I just need a better weapon? Is that the problem? Do I need to jump between the bullets like a huge bat? Oh, I think I had extra life. I heard a ding. I'm assuming that's what the ding means. Ah! I gotta love these backgrounds, like, there's stars, here's no stars. Maybe this is snow and no snow? I don't know. I don't know what this, like, metal floor is about. It's built in the side of this mountain. Okay, so you're gonna... We're doing this, apparently. Uh, now that I know the explosions linger and they're a scary thing. Okay, uh, 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 la oh, no, I can't get up there! Lasers? No, lasers! Those are probably good. They're what I've got now. Oh, actually. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, are you serious? It's right the Yeah, laying down made me longer. That's a weird sentence. But it's accurate, you saw it. It happened. You can't deny it. Alright. Now bring it on, Carmobile. Carmobile? Alright. Or is this Oh! What is this thing? I don't actually know what this is. Hello. Ah! Space alien! Maybe. I don't know. Okay, so you're good against these at least. Cool. Do I have to shoot this at all? Yeah, 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 yeah! Okay, so this is good on these. I'll just hit you whenever you first appear. That seems like a plan to me. Here we go. Woo! Yeah, and then this, oh, this is the perfect type for this. Oh yeah, who said Contra was hard? Ignore the 20 deaths up to this point. Yeah! Never before seen boss defeated, first try. Why was I seeing through those pipes? Hmm. 
in old NES fashion. A lot of uh, bosses and stuff are backgrounds. <laughs> and it's just, it's just a giant picture in the background. Or it's just, I guess it, that one was, oh, ooh, yeah, that's what Conjure sounds like. <laughs> um, it wasn't necessarily a background thing, because I walked in front of it, but it was just a giant image and all the, the black was just a lack of color. Ugh. Ah. Aha! I wasn't long enough to pick up this machine gun! Oh! Oh, get out of my way, you! Oh, wait, excuse me, coming through. Laser. Hello, laser delivery! Contra has a, a brand new service just for you. Uh, it's laser delivery. We're giving you a free sample uh, here today, at this very moment. If you'd like to accept it, um, that'd be good. Ah! <laughs> that was perfect timing to murder me! <laughs> <laughs> Did not see it coming. I, I mean, I saw the little flickering thing up there. I thought it was just a background element. I was like, oh, look at that. Ah! <laughs> look at that cute little thing. Okay, this is just activate when you get near it. Is that what we're doing? It might be. Oh, that was. How would I react to that? That's so long. I didn't know that was going to happen. <laughs> Again, in Hard Corps, uh, there's an area that has an uh, area of fire like this. That's cool. I guess it was homage to this. I never knew it. Um, can I just break those? Hello? Can you shoot them off the wall? No? Okay. Oop. See, you take so long to land, I'm really worried they're just gonna do something while I'm like mid-air, mid-jump. Okay, I could go over there. Okay, you're just gonna- you're gonna be a- oh, oh, I saw that! Oh, you suck! Okay, B for bomb. Actually, that's totally accurate. Ah, ah. No, B for Invincible! <laughs> I'm Invincible now! All fear me, I'm Invincible. I also am doing a bad Schwarzenegger. I don't know why. I mean, it makes sense. We've been over this. He's made to look like Schwarzenegger. Alright, I don't know how long this lasts. Just, ah! <laughs> As I was talking about it! It doesn't, like, have a tune change. How Are you serious? It, like, can just drop? Yes. Okay, that one apparently fires just really fast. Alright, is it time for uh, Linebacker Man? Everyone's favorite boss. He's terrifying. There he is! Linebackerman! Look at him! He's just- Oh! Uh, what am I supposed to do with that? I'm supposed to jump over him. Oh, okay, I can just shoot him his big tush. Good to know. Oh! Yeah, what you gonna do, Linebackerman? Ah! He threw a Beyblade at me! Or a yo-yo with blades on it. Basically the same thing. Oh, come on! He jumped so slow and floatily. Okay, I was waiting. Oh! Don't touch me! Ah! <laughs> Oh, I hate you. Uh, uh, no! It takes so long. Oh, I've got one life left. One life to live. I don't want to die to linebackerman. Uh, uh. Come on. Yeah! We got a life out of that. Oh, yeah! Take that linebacker, man. And I'm back. So, sorry for random edit there. I was looking over at my, uh, my audio capture and suddenly everything was really loud so if for some reason my audio just midway through the uh, the video gets like to be you know butt quality um i apologize that was not intentional i i the first part was fine it seemed like oh, i was writing the thing i was not timed <laughs> doesn't mean i'm gonna you know pass the game or anything but um oh hello spike wall thought that was gonna come at me or something it did not how are you doing? Also, I mean, these guys kind of look like linebackers too, don't they? A little bit. I was making fun of that one guy, but uh, these are also kind of that. So I guess it's just to keep us from continually moving forward in our run and gun game. No running for you, only gun. Walk and gun. Stop and gun. It's the original stop and pop. Are you... Are you serious? I do... Not only... Not only did we die to a wall, we died to a wall because I was staying next to it, and then I ducked, and it makes you slightly more forward. It makes you longer, as I said earlier. Oh well. At least, uh, we did discover something. You do get to continue. Do I- wait, do I start with 30 lives? Oh, that was the plan the whole time! I'm invincible now! Oh, guys, you- oh, do you understand my genius? Hey, we're just gonna go this way. That other way, so- Ah! <laughs> Good night. Not in the game, though. <laughs> I saw that earlier and I forgot. Like, I was in the middle of saying I'm gonna go the easier way, because that other way will kill me. And then I jumped into a bullet. Like a hero. Okay. Uh, give me this R for rapid fire. Rapid reload. Actually, that's a, that's a cool running gun game. I believe it's made by the same people who make Gunstar Heroes. 
looks and plays very similar. Uh, Japanese only release. I have it on the Japanese uh, PSN. It's the first, I guess technically the first import game I ever had. Uh, but it was digital, but still. That's pretty fun. Psycho is not as good as Gunstar Heroes, but it's fun. Oh! Oh! Oh, hide here in the spikes! <laughs> okay, can I touch this floor? Hello? Okay, I need you. Oh! Sneaky. See that sneakiness? B for uh, invincibility. We learned this. Earth. Does that hurt you if you touch it from the side? That would be dumb. Man, I don't know how long this lasts. It's terrifying. I don't like it. Okay, so let's not... I'm not even going to risk it. I'm just going to not jump into anything. M for... Mmm, gun. Yeah. Oh, it's so fast. I wonder... Is it because... Oh, I can actually just hold this down. <laughs> that would make sense if it's you know, a machine gun, but I was mashing it. Is it going any faster if I do it that way? No. Okay, cool. Hey, I found the easy gun. Just hold down the button. Nice. Nice. So up to this point... Uh, if it looked like I was rapid firing, it's because I was just mashing the button as fast as the game could render it. So that's cool. I say render, like rendering was even a thing at this point. <laughs> this is, this is the NES. Okay, so just gonna alternate, yeah. That's cool. Whoop, whoop. And by cool, I mean easy. Whoop. Whoop. What are these for? Who built this? Oh, 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 it's like that scene from Galaxy Quest. You have the big, the mashers everywhere. It's like, who designed this? Why would you make something like this? I mean, at least this is like the evil, whoever the crap they are. Ah. Oh. Evil organization of evil people. No, I hate holding forward and down makes me like, oh, now I gotta mash again. Okay, yeah. See, so like, just, like, I'm even just, I'm only holding the down button, but if I rotate my thumb slightly on the down button, it's sensitive enough to move it. That's, that's kind of nuts. So, I'll take most, I mean, I still screwed up, but like, man, that's kind of gross. Oh, I mean, kind of crap, not gross. But, um, look, this is what the, ow, <laughs> this is what those, uh, like, mid-stage levels look like from the side. So it's like when you play a game, it's like, whoa, this looks like it first person. This is what it looks like in actual ContraVision, a side-scroller, <laughs> as it was always meant to be. It's kind of cool now I think about it, that even though it's the original game, the first one they made, they still mix it up by adding, like, various, you know, a different game mode. That's kind of cool. I can see myself through the cracks as I walk through that. That's weird. Stage 8, Aliens Lair. I, I'm sure they won't look like anything legally copyrighted. These will be legally distinct aliens, and you will like it. Oop. Grab this. Oh, okay, I'm gonna go back up there. It's a- that jumps a little tight. <laughs> hey, oh no! Okay, so that, that only- I mean, that only kinda looks like another kind of alien. That- that doesn't look like a giant xenomorph head. What are you talking about? Look, it's spitting floaty babies. That xenomorphs don't do that. That's just silly. What are you talking about? What is this? <laughs> it's a, it, this is basically a wall boss. Again, on the NES, there's a lot of uh, bosses and stuff there. It's like it's just that's that's just a giant sprite in the background. So the way they can make it that big, which is kind of you know the Mega Man games did that a lot. Oh, oh no! Disgusting wall mouth mouths with heat-seeking dandelion heads. <laughs> that's what it looked like to me. Yep, or. Gross, goopy thing. I don't know what that is. I hate it. I hate all of it. So, I feel like- I don't even know if it was this one. I, I, it had to have been one of the other Contras. I, I know I've never beaten this Contra. SPREAD GUN! Spread, 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 yes! The iconic spread gun that everyone loves. It's, it's good. It's not as useful in this game as it is in other ones, because, like, the, the spread don't spread as spreadly as other spreads spread. Um, not having a seizure. Shut up. <laughs> but, um... But yeah, I know, in place of the other ones, like, you get near the end, maybe it was Contra 3, um, or Hard Corps, one of those, whatever, you get to the end, and it's just aliens, it's suddenly just aliens, this was in the 80s, so, you know, cool sci-fi alien, gross horror garbage, love it, <laughs> it's like, gar garbage, I love it, oh, spread gun's so good, ah, that's not a face hugger, shut up, it's, it's legally distinct, <laughs> it's just a face hugger. <laughs> Which makes it cool! Alright, time to fight this alien heart. I mean, I'm pretty sure one of the, um... The Contra-inspired indie games we played... Ah, we played... Oh, we don't have a bomb. Some games get bombs. Um... Had a giant heart boss that was an homage to this one. And I can't remember if I noticed that at the time. I feel like I might have. 
But, uh, can I sneak on? Aw. You got extra life right as we died, so that worked out. Um, but yeah, so. Uh, giant heart boss! It's just a heart. So is this the heart of the alien's head that we just exploded? Because I feel like it shouldn't be much of a threat. We blew its head up. But then again, it is still hatching not face huggers. These are, um, butt squeezers. Uh, yeah, you know, the iconic Contra butt squeezer. Uh, that's what it is. Don't worry about it. And the Wait, is that- Whoa! We completed Contra! NA, North America. Okay, 1987, that's when that came out. That was the end boss? It was just a non-moving heart? Congratulations! You've destroyed the vile Red Falcon and saved the universe somehow. Consider yourself a hero. Yeah! We are Contra! We are the heroes that everyone needed. Staff! Okay, <laughs> Whoa. I wonder if there's anybody in this staff. It seems to be a black screen. <laughs> I was watching something recently that was talking about how, like, credits are really long in current games, but old games also had long credits, even though they were made by, like, ten people. See how many we have? We got five there, five graphic designers, but they move at, like, the, the speed of smell. So, <laughs> it lasts a long time. Okay, so we had five graphic designers, two, or I think these can be, like, uh, like, repeats or anything. And then we had two sound designers. Special thanks to those people. Directed by this guy. So we had 12, 13... Is that one guy or two guys? I don't know. Directed by, I guess, that one guy. There may have only been, like, 12 people who worked on this. And then we had a bunch of special thanks. Presented by Konami! Back when they were super cool. They used to be pretty cool, actually. Made a lot of good stuff. Oh! Yeah! I love that music! It's so good! Man, Konami, put out more games! Where's Bloody Roar? I know you own that now! Anyway, so hey, this has been Contra! The original, the OG, the one and only! Until I made a bunch more. Um, this game's still fun. It's actually a lot shorter than I realized it would be. For being, you know, a original NES game, I guess it makes sense. There, I managed to get over the bridge. Um, it's still cool, though. Um, if we didn't have the, you know, Konami code with the 30 lives, this would have taken a lot longer. Uh, but hey, we still did all one go. Like, I had to use a continue once. I know as a kid, at least, the Konami code would not have been enough to keep me around. Oh, it's, I think it's the same screen I died on the first time. <laughs> um, so hey, gamer skill improved from when I was like five. <laughs> I would freaking hope so. But hey, I'm excited about the new game. We'll see how it compares to this one. Uh, demo already has me uh, really liking it, but ignoring that, judging this on its own merits, I still think it is a solid NES game. I like it a lot. There's a reason this spawned a franchise. And the, I mean, the, let me know what you guys think. <laughs> it sounds like such a, a pandering, like, hey, what are you doing? No, I actually, I love these games. I love run and gun, like action games. What do, you, what do you think of this game? What's your favorite Contra? Do you have any other run and, gun, run and gun games for me to check out? Because I need more. I always need more of these in my life. Please, gimme. We'll end this by finishing off this boss in one go without taking a hit. And look like a huge badass, even though we did that earlier too, anyway. And see, this is what the spread gun's for. As long as you don't fire it a bunch, because then it just becomes a regular gun. It doesn't spread worth of crap. Uh, anyway, I love this game. This, this is good. I love this franchise. It's good. Um, but hey, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Take care, and I will see you next time. Onward we go to heroism.